it's Ruby and today I'm going to be talking about The American Dream in The Great Gatsby by F. Scott Fitzgerald. The American Dream was defined by James Truslow Adams, the dream of a land in which life should be better and richer and fuller for everyone, with opportunity for each according to ability and achievement, regardless of circumstance of birth or position. This idea of the American dream became a staple part of the 1920s, and it fuels Gatsby in everything that he does, specifically in his wish to claim Daisy. However, as humans, we will never be satisfied. Socrates quite rightly said, He who is not contented with what he has would not be contented with what he would like to have. Gatsby has escaped from the poverty of North Dakota and he has become stinking rich. Just like many of those individuals who were involved in organised crime during this period, you had Al Capone who was earning $60 million a year. But despite having all of this, Gatsby is still stretching out his arm towards the dock light, towards what he does not have. Nick remarks that they are trembling, in quite the same way as they would be if he were crying. Or perhaps he has been standing here for so long that he's finding it hard to keep up his hand. In all of his wealth, Nick cannot understand this. He says, I could have sworn he was trembling. This implies some hesitancy. Nick cannot imagine why somebody with so much would be stretching out towards the dark, cold water. The reason is because Gatsby still needs Daisy. But that's the thing, when he finally does get her, as Socrates observed, he still isn't content, and he needs for her to admit that she never even loved Tom. At first, Daisy tries to say that she never did love her husband but she realises that this is not the case and her hesitancy to hurt Tom in this way suggests that she still does actually have feelings for him. Marius Bewley has said that Gatsby is the withering of the American dream and when Nick imagines Gatsby finally giving up moments before his death, we know this to be true. It's when we see the leaves tracing Gatsby's body as it floats in the pool that he insisted wouldn't be emptied. This is a very short video, it was meant to just be a snappy indication of the American Dream and the Great Gatsby. This video was inspired by Revision with Eve, who posted a live discussion and revision video um, for the Great Gatsby. I, I watched the majority of it and it was really so useful. If you haven't watched it, I definitely recommend that you go over to her channel. I will leave the link down below. Thank you for watching and have a productive week.